Well, welcome back to the Amherst Railroad Show here in Springfield, Massachusetts. We're here with John McKesh uh, from Aristocraft Trains as well as Ready Made Toys. And he's here to tell us a little bit about the O-Gage line and some of the exciting things that are coming this later this year. John, it's good to see you. Yeah, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. So in your hand there is a brand new depressed center flat with a uh, load. Can you tell us a little Correct. bit about it? This is our DRMT depressed center flat car. Uh, comes with a tank load. This car will be uh, available next month. All right, so that one's just around the corner. Right. All right. Uh, suggested retail price on the car is $99.95. Great. So a lot of other things, too, in the line. You've got a few things behind us. Getting ready to ship uh, a new paint scheme in the F unit. Correct. Here, I'll hold one for you. All right. The F units, uh, new paint schemes. Uh, the F units come two F units together. The AA. Two A's, okay. Okay, they plug in together, so if one unit loses power while going over a switch, it will get power from the other unit. When That's you plug a great it in. feature. Uh, also, uh, we're selling the B units. B units will be sold separately. So you can make an ABA set then? So yes, you can make an ABBA set or an ABA set or you can just run uh, AA together. Perfect. All right. Next one on the list is a really neat release. This is an upgraded tool. It's a Pensy N5C caboose. Correct. Uh, has lighted interior. Has figures sitting in a cupola with the windows. Uh, has a train phone antenna. With the Pennsylvania Railroad used to use. And it also has uh, metal handrails, is that correct? Correct. Handrails are metal on, on it and other detail parts, die cast trucks with the All car. Right. All right, and then the next thing that we have, uh, I'll hand you the locomotive and I'll grab the tender. Okay, this is the K line die cast locomotive, uh, boilers die cast. Uh, we've upgraded the drive, has die cast wheels, has operating headlight and marker lights. All right, and this one is coming in the fall, this, correct? Yes, this will be available uh, fall 2011. All right, and that's what, that's the same as the caboose as well? Correct. All right, and another release that's coming this summer with some pretty significant changes is a new S4? Correct. It's the Alco S, S4. Uh, we've upgraded the tooling on this. We've opened up the windows in the back, uh, new exhaust stack and bell. Uh, we've added strobe light. We'll have working marker lights in the back of the locomotive and front. All right. So some great releases coming up later this year. John, thank you very much. And let's thank go you. talk about some large scale. Okay. We've now put out the RDC-3. It's now available. Uh, we did eight road names for the RDC-3. It has, uh, this RDC-3 has full interior, including the mail and baggage area. Uh, full interior for the passenger area. has directional headlights and working marker lights. They're directional operated. I got to tell you, this is really impressive, and I was uh, I was really blown away by how how heavy it is when you when you first pick it up, and it feels like it is it all aluminum. Yes, it's extruded aluminum. aluminum. Uh, both trucks are powered, has a working smoke in it, and it has the Revolution plug in it, so it's RCC DCC ready. Perfect. Now you've also are holding a brand new consolidation. Yes, this is the B and O E27 class uh, 280 steam locomotive. Uh, this will be done in six road names and it'll be available this June. I noticed that a couple of, uh, you got looks like an engineer and a fireman in the in the cab? Correct. Uh, this is full de detailed cab with engineer and fireman. Uh, has a lit cab. We'll have working classification and headlights. Uh, we'll have a working uh, headlight in the rear of the tender for backup moves. And we'll be equipped with the RCC DCC port. Uh, be set up for sound. So you want to do is add your sound card and it's ready to go.